All right, guys, to get started, we'll go to skybox.blocketlabs.com and right away you'll be welcomed with the 360 image, which is very beautiful. It is crazy that we can create 360 images with just text prompts. I know it is crazy with the mid journey, tally, and all of that stuff. But here, uh, go ahead and type uh, a prompt that you would like. I was going for something dramatic a sky with the stormy cloud nothing related with uh, stormy daniels in any sense uh, but yeah i was looking for something with uh, lightning flashes and there are different modes but i was going with the digital painting but you can go ahead and explore whatever mode you want and then i'll go ahead and click the generate button and make this ai work for me and yeah it will show you that green progress bar and you'll know when it's done and it's done right here it is crazy that we can generate this within a minute or less than that actually yeah so the idea is to download this and take it to unreal so we'll click on download and by default when you download it actually downloads in a jpeg format but we need to convert it to sdr because we're going to use it as a skybox so let's open this in adobe photoshop and in photoshop that's where we do some magic so I think the format is good but only thing we need to do is go to image and go to mode and then make sure you select the 32-bit channel and uh, after that is done let's go ahead and file save as make sure it's file save as because that's uh, the only place where you'll see the option to save as a SDR don't click on save uh, so go ahead and click on save as and make sure the format is dot SDR radiance and then click on save next we'll go to the unreal engine i have the unreal engine already set up just a mannequin and then the skybox so go to edit plugins and then make sure the sdri backdrop plugin is checked it might ask you to restart your unreal engine go ahead and restart the unreal engine and I'll create a new folder here saying SDR, but you don't have to. I like to be organized. So I'll go ahead and import the SDR. Make sure you import the SDR that you saved from the Photoshop. So double click on the SDR and it should pop up the, uh, basically the, the description. And the only thing we need to do is actually under texture group, change it to skybox. So just type skybox. So that will ensure that this is a skybox and we'll save it go to place actor type in sdri then go ahead and drag the sdri backdrop right away you will see the sdri backdrop in there by default uh, you might see the purple logo on top as well like a icon we'll play with that later so go ahead and change the cube map to the one that we imported the sdri and voila there you go you have a ai powered sdri next uh sometimes you might need to squeeze some things to make it work you know quite right so you'll see when you click on the sdri there is that um the projects um, thing that you can actually drag and make it work and there you have it also another thing if you want to change the light and stuff go to the click on the sdri and you can actually go on the skylight section as well but yeah this would be all for this video leave me a message and yeah i'll see you in the next one